In chronological order, these are the extinction events that affected evolution and genetic diversity on a mass scale. The Ordovician Silurian extinction was the second largest extinction to have ever occurred. Most of the species that died off were those in the tropical oceans. However, about 85% of all of the species that existed at that time became extinct. Two events contributed to this drastic reduction in species diversity, rapid cooling and the lowering of sea level due to glaciation. This severely limited the amount of habitat available for the species that previously lived there. The extinctions that occurred during the late Devonian time period are responsible for the elimination of 70 to 80 percent of all animal species present during the Devonian. There were periods of widespread hypoxic or anoxic sedimentation. Environmental stress took place when high global temperatures slowed the mixing rate between the ocean surface and deeper layers. Bottom waters experienced a lower reoxygenation rate, which may have resulted in the extinction of many marine species. Scientists believe that the end Permian extinction began with a series of volcanic eruptions that released massive amounts of carbon dioxide which caused a change in ocean chemistry. As the waters got warmer, oxygen was released leaving behind hydrogen sulfide which killed most ocean creatures. The levels of hydrogen sulfide were so high in some parts of the ocean that it seeped out of the water surface and into the atmosphere killing land creatures. Known as the greatest mass extinction event in history, end Permian killed 95% of species on earth at the time. The end Triassic extinction accounted for the demise of 76% of all marine and terrestrial species. It is thought that the end Triassic extinction was the key moment that allowed dinosaurs to become the dominant land animals on Earth since it opened up many ecological niches. Possible causes of the mass extinction are results from the release of carbon dioxide from widespread volcanic activity associated with the rifting of Pangaea. The end Cretaceous extinction was a mass extinction event that eliminated about 75% of all living species. The widely accepted theory behind this is that a massive asteroid hit the Earth, causing tons of debris to cloud the atmosphere. This led to the ecosystem collapsing because sunlight and atmospheric gases could not operate normally. However, some scientists still believe other theories such as volcanic eruption, climate change, and sea level change. This extinction event wiped out all land-dwelling dinosaurs and many other exotic species. These extinction events paved the way for modern species and genetic diversity we see on Earth today.